challenge so they can have an idea where a lot of their food comes from and oh. so they can have a look around and see if there's any other foods that we've got here that they might want to have. Oh, got cool. a, a pretty choked Should I come along here to work? Yeah. Cardamom? No. Oh, I know what it is. It's uh. I don't know how to make that. Makes it oh. Star? Mm, no, it's not star uh, anise. Uh, 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 allspice. 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 Uh, so, if we were wanting to use cinnamon as a spice, like let's say in baking or in a beverage, mm -hmm. you could how would we use it from you, this? We would use it um, specifically in this form taste, in a tea. Taste this. You can make a tea from the leaves. And then you either put the, a little bit of the, the tea in your baking, or you just drink the tea. Oh my god, that is so cinnamon. Yeah. Wow. And then normally cinnamon comes from the bark of the trees. That's really good, isn't it, you guys? Wow. It's really cinnamon. It's, it's really cinnamon. Mm -hmm. Clove oil? Mm -hmm. You were talking about clove oil, right? Well, this is the plant that they come from. These are a little late, but if you want to try out of clove, these are spicy, so again, Hold that I'll bring like them home for my dad. And just like these, pretty much. Um, they're a little bit different. Try that one out. This one's a little I'm, bit yeah. different. I'm just gonna bring one home okay. for my dad. You bring one home for you. Some curry. Well, it it smells a little different. You might want to smell it before you decide that you want to smell that. Mm, I'll smell it. Okay. Here, take a leaf. What is we'll it? Keep that home. This is called the curry leaf, the curry bush. Mm. I'll take some curry. curry. Yeah. Yeah. So you can use these oh, leaves in cooking. I, I, I noticed I had yeah. a lemongrass. This is the shorter version. The other stuff's called citronella grass. This is, this is lemongrass. Can you eat it? Can you? Um, you can. It just it's not gonna taste like it smells. You think it would taste better than it tastes. Doesn't nutmeg come from the bark of the tree? Nutmeg actually comes from the fruit. Right, that the tree produces, and it produces a hard and, nut. Um, the outside of the nut is called mace, and the inside of the nut is called nutmeg. Everybody step back. I'm gonna now this one's this one's called the chempadak, and this one is related to the jackfruit. It tastes pretty much just like the jackfruit. It's just a little bit sweeter, and it's smaller. <laughs> For those of you guys who've never eaten it, this is the part that you eat most of the time, and then you can use the seeds and other stuff. Mm -hmm. This is a key lime. Not like a lime. Try that out on something at home. So this is where pineapples come from. In case you guys have never seen what they do, well, I'm not handing these out. I know you want it, but I'm not handing these out. In case you haven't seen how they grow, what happens is this plant will get really big, and then it'll start making one of these on top, and it'll go whoop, and then you get big. That's a small one, I thought. And this is a small one. They get twice as big. I just saw a split Malabar chestnut here, and so he's gonna bring the whole thing over and see if there's any inside. Uh huh. And it's. And he'll be the divvier of those if anybody wants one and he wants to share. You guys know how to eat them right. Don't put that outside part in your mouth. Remember, you have to break the trees right there. And those, the little fruits on them, when they turn red, they're edible. And there's actually some that are almost red back in there that I'm looking at. Do you think they'll be ripe? They might be ripe by two weeks. That's a dwarf bee apple. Really? Yeah, you gotta wait until they're squishy. Uh, and some of them might be ready by next week or by the I see an orange one right here. If it's if it's kind of smushy, it might be ready, but they're not quite right. ready. And, no, no. You guys want to see where vanilla comes from? You guys from? good? Sure. I, I'm done. I don't. I already. Vanilla. Oh, vanilla. Ooh, is this a mom? It's beginning. I have vanilla at home though, so like we could see the beginning of what vanilla is, and then the stuff that I got at home is gone through the whole process. The process is like a six month process. I don't like to take showers. Oh, I see they're not all, oh, there's very few that are ready. I think that only one was ready. So Gabe is going around. You guys try to taste the one that's coming around. Oh, wow. I like sour. I only got 
There's one. another one there with Dylan. Can I grab one? Mm. Oh. I got this. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> again, so, I, like I don't want to be like that. That looks kind of too tough. <laughs> you? That's the you pickle fruit. Oh, it. yeah. There'll be more of those look, available uh, during the next look week it, or two. Look it. And then there's look a. Look it. <laughs> It's an edible leaf that grows on these big trees that you can knock down and they grow back. And it's got um, more protein. Chai? Chaya. Or, Mex or Mayan spinach, I learned yesterday. And um, it's got more protein than meat. And it's got more calcium than... No, it doesn't have. That's Moringa. It has more calcium than milk. But it has more protein than meat. So I thought that was pretty cool. About it. And then down here, another kind of green that you guys could eat. Uh, but don't eat it raw unless we all check it and clean it. Yeah. Is the edible hibiscus. And this stuff is a lot of beautiful leaves. This is another edible drink. But you don't have to eat the berries. What? Those are berries? Hey. You can eat the flowers too. You can eat everything. Except the stem. Yep. Everyone gets one. Everyone only gets one though. Okay. I want one. So. I got one. Ten people in this entire room. Okay, so what you do is you bite off the end, this little part at the end, until there's a little hole there. And then you take a couple little bites. And then, there's a little bit of sugar at the bottom. Did you get one, Duga? I got one. Bye, everybody. 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 Bye, everybody.